I really like plate racks for doing combative pistol training. A, a lot of people seem to get confused, you know, a plate rack is only for competition shooting, and that's really not the case. If you think about what plate racks can represent, you can get a lot of really good combative training out of them. First of all, you're shooting at an 8-inch circle that's very reminiscent of the high chest area, that, that thoracic cavity that we're trying to hit. And on a well-designed plate rack, those plates are right at chest height. But don't think it's all just about mowing plates down. You know, you can shoot a plate, do a reload, shoot a plate, or shoot this plate, shoot that plate. All kinds of different things you can do, plus you get that immediate feedback that we're all looking for. And that immediate feedback keeps you from wanting to score your targets. You know, where you're shooting and you want to lift up to look at that hole in the paper and come back down. Plates kind of keep you behind the gun going from plate to plate or back and forth or whatever the case may, may be. Now what's the disadvantage of the plate rack? Well, as you can see, I shot them down. So what I gotta do now is I gotta walk over here. I gotta grab a hold of the rope, pull them up. Hopefully they'll stay. In this case they did, maybe not. You know, sometimes in police ranges or, or gun club plate racks, they get a little bit rusty, they need some lubrication, and you can't really get them to reset. But the fact is, you've got to reset them every time you shoot them, which can kind of put a lull in your training that maybe you don't want. With that in mind, I asked law enforcement targets to create a training plate rack. And let me show you what I'm talking about. Essentially, it's just a plate rack turned upside down. So that when you hit them, they reset themselves by gravity. Now, why would you want this? Well, again, so that you can continue to train without having to stop and pull the thing up. Uh, law enforcement targets, at my request, is making two different types. This one's got 20-inch centers so that it's more like the standard Bianchi plate rack. They're also making a model that's got a 14-inch center so it's shorter and allows you to send it through common carriers like UPS. Um, these come in three plate sections. You can bolt them together to make a full length plate. Or in this particular case, it's short. So if I just take these legs off, which just slide off, I can put this in the bed of my pickup truck and use it in classes. But most importantly, it allows me to do a lot of training without having to stop and reset. Let's go back and show you what I'm talking about. Okay, the same thing we basically did on the bigger plate rack, the longer plate rack. And oh, by the way, if you were wondering, that last run was three seconds with the draw, so I'm pretty happy with that. But what it allows us to do is do the same basic stuff without having to reset. As you can see, I shoot that plate, I get that ring, you can see the thing move, I get good feedback, so no big deal. It's basically the same thing, but now I don't have to pull on the cord. So. Yep, I missed. But you know what? If you never miss, then you don't know what your threshold is. The only way you can improve yourself as a shooter is to occasionally miss. So don't uh, think of a miss as kind of a training scar. Think of it as a learning opportunity. But as you can see, oops, I can get a whole lot of shooting done without having to stop and pull and reset the plates. Can you use these for training for competition? Sure you could. Why couldn't you? But, you know, if you've got uh, law enforcement training or you're doing the kind of combative pistol training I do, having a rack like this that just resets itself so you can keep the training going, it's really, really invaluable. And like so many other things that law enforcement target makes, it's portable. I can take this thing with me in the bed of my pickup truck. So if you're looking for a, a plate rack that will allow you to do combative style training, something you don't have to stop periodically and pull the damn thing upward, take a look at these plates right here. Again, it's just called the training plate rack and I think what you're going to find is you're going to find yourself a pretty easy to use tool that's really going to help you enhance your combative pistol skills.